Hello YouTube and welcome! In this video I would like to do with you the unboxing of this booster box from the new set Terrors Beyond Death. First of all I would like to thanks to Duels de Honra, a game star from Amadora Portugal that makes this unboxing possible for you. So let's open this booster box and get a 36 booster marathon. Put it aside just to be easiest to check the cards. So first booster. So passing through rapidly from the commons. Our first uncommon Wolf Willow Heaven. Glimpse of Freedom. Nessian. Wanderer and a rare Adilon of Obstruction to drops. He has first strike, loyalty abilities are of Planeswalker. Your opponent's controls cost one more to activate, and it is a 2 1. And we have an Iceland and a wolf token creature. Mischievous Chimera, Hedios Punishment, Saga of Mysteries, and our rare Allure of the Unknown. Five drops reveal the top six cards of your library. An opponent exiles a non land card from among them, then you put the rest into your hands. That opponent may cast the exiled card without paying its mana cost. And we have a forest and a wall token. Banishing light. Hero of the Winds, Underworld Fires, and our rare Temple of Malice. Temple of Malice enters in the battlefield, tap it. When Temple of Malice enters in the battlefield, scry one, tap it for a swamp or a mountain. We have a swamp, and we have our first foiled triumphant search. And another token. Let's see if I can arrange this better. Okay. The Binding of Titans, I'll say it of the Living's Bounty, Eutropia of Twice Favorite, and our rare Heliod's Intervention, X and two planes, choose one, destroy X target artifacts and or enchantments, or target player gains twice X life. Interesting card. You have a plane. And a Kraken token. Blood Aspirant. Satisan Pioneer. Stinging Lionfish. And our rare Temple of Enlightenment. Temple of Enlightenment enters in the battlefield, tap it. When it enters the battlefield, scry one. You tap it for a plane or an island. 
you have a mountain and a human token. Angonizing Remorse, Chainweb Arachnir, Favorite of Iris, and a rare Wave Break Hypocamp, 3 drops. Whenever you cast your first spell during each opponent's turn, draw a card, and it is a 2 2. Very interesting card, this one. A forest, and another token. Sage Ring Insight. Wow, with a different art. Renata called it of the hunt. Very nice card, this one. The Birth of Malatis. And a rare. Nightmare Shepherd. For drops, he has flying. Whenever another non tonked creature you control dies, you may sell it. If you do create a token that is a copy of that creature, except it is a 1-1 one, one, and it is a nightmare in addition to the other types and it is a 4-4. Four, four. And we have a mountain and we have a foiled uncommon Meadow Maze Prophecy. Nice art. And another human token. Dream Stalker Manticore, Archon of the Falling Stars, Dream Shaper Shaman, and a rare Mantle of the Wolf for drops, Enchanted Creature. Enchanted Creature gets plus 4 plus 4. When Mantle of the Wolf is put in the graveyard from the battlefield, create 2 2 2 Wolf creature tokens. Nice. We have a mountain. We have another foil. Scholar Grove Dancer. And a human token. Whirlwind Denial, Cling to Dust, Sweet Oblivion, and a rare Labyrinth of Scophos. Tap it for a colorless mana. For 4 tap it, remove target attacking or blocking creature from combat. Nice. Have a Swamp and a Spider Token. Entrance Liar, Scofos Maze Warden, Careless Celebrant, and our rare is a mythic, nice, a planeswalker, Esfet Sand Nemesis, 4 drops, he has 5 loyalty points, 4 minus 1, up to 2 target creatures you control, each gets plus 2 plus 1 until the end of the turn, 4 minus 2 create 2 1 1 white soldier human creature tokens and for minus three you gain five lives nice card great card this one i have a mountain and a foiled great booster nixborn seaguard 
and we have a tentacle token. My retreatant, commanding presence, the triumph of Anax, and a rare, crazy, another planeswalker, another mythic, four drops, four minus one, one to two target creatures you control, each gets plus two plus one until the end of the turn, four minus two create two one one white human soldier creature tokens. And for minus three, you get five lives. And it has escape. Now I see it is the, the same planeswalker, but with different art. So I forgot to, to say the escape. For six, exile, exile four other cards from your graveyard. You may cast this card from your graveyard for its escape cost. So we get the same planeswalker with two different arts, a mountain, and again with a foiled escape velocity. Great effect in this one. And publicity card. Shimmering Chimera, Slaughter Priest of Morgis, Hateful Eidolon, and our rare, Satisan Champion, 3 drops, he has Constellation, whenever an enchantment enters the battlefield under your control, put a plus one plus one counter on Satisan Champion, and you draw a card, and it is a 1-3, great card. And we have a swamp, and we have a rare foil. Hedion's Intervention, X and 2 white, choose one, destroy X artifact or enchantment, or target player gets twice X life. And we have a reflection token, like I see we have in this booster box, the same rare one we filed in another normal. Let's continue. Should we get more surprises in this booster box? Let's see. Timaret chosen from the death, favorite of Iris, Chainweb Arachnir, and our rare, we have a saga card, the first Iron Games, three drops, the first turn create a 1-1 one, one white human soldier creature token, turn two, put three plus one plus one counter on target creature you control, turn three, if you control a creature with power 4 or greater, draw 2 cards and the 4th turn create a gold token. Interesting. And we have a forest and a gold token. Sea God Scorn, Faricus Spawn, Warden of the Chained, and our rare Archon of Sun Grace. For drops, he has Flying and Lifelink. Pegasus creatures you control have Lifelink, and he has Constellation. Whenever an enchantment enters in the battlefield under your control, create a 2 2 white Pegasus creature token with Flying, and it is a 3 4. Interesting card, this one also. And I have a plane and an elemental token creature. I 
Acolyte of Infliction, Worldwind Denied, Ferris Band Brawler, and a rare. Again, the Setisan Champion, an Iceland, and a Human Token. Show all Kraken, Laguna Band Storyteller, Enemy of Enlightenment, and a rare Thrix of the Sudden Storm, 5 drops, he has Flash, Flying, spells you cast with the converted mana cost 5 or greater cost 1 less to cast and it can't be countered, and it is a 4-5, interesting, have a Mountain and a Goat Token. Tedring Insight, Threnody Singer, Wonderworld Dreams, and a rare Temple of Abaddon, enters in the battlefield, tap it. When enters the battlefield, scry one and tap it for a mountain or a forest. And we have an Iceland, and we have Edion's Punishment, foiled. And some publicity cards. Renata, color of the hunt. Great image. Stinging lionfish. Impending doom. And a rare, it is a mythic, a god, purpurous, bronze blooded, with uh, alternative art, 5 drops, he has indestructibility, as long as your devotion to red is less than 5, purpurous isn't a creature, other creatures you control have haste, and for free, you may put a red creature card or an artifact creature card from your hand to the battlefield, sacrifice it at the beginning of next and stamp, and it is a 7-6. Great. And we have a plane and a human token. So, so far, three mythics. Two of them with the different art. Skofos Maze Warden, Daxos Blessed by the Sun, Medomai's Prophecy, and a rare Bronze Hide Lion, two drops, for two Bronze Lion hand, Lion gains indestructibility until the end of the turn. When Bronze Hide Lion dies, return it to the battlefield. It is an aura enchantment with enchantment creature you control gets a for two, enchantment creature gains indestructibility until the end of the turn, and it is it is lost all other abilities, and it is a three three. Great card. You have a plane. We have a rare foil. Protean Tolmaturge. I think he's called it this way. Two drops. He has constellation whenever an enchantment enters the battlefield under your control. You may have Protean Tomarturch become a copy of another target creature, except it is he has this ability and it is a 1-1. One, one. Great. Another token.
Inevitable End, Underworld Dreams, Siona, Captain of the Palace, and our rare, the Archon War, for drops, first turn, gain control of target creature for as long as the Archon War remains in the battlefield, second turn, until your next turn, creatures your opponent controls attacks each combat if able, and the third turn, each tapped creature deals damage to himself equal to his power. Nice. Plane and a nightmare token. Heroes of the Reveal, Dwan Evangel, Fields of Ruin, and a rare. Dalakos, Crafter of Wonders, he has 3 drops, tap it for add 2 colors mana, spend this mana only to cast artifact spells or activate abilities of artifacts, equip creatures you control have flying and haste, and it is a 2-4, interesting card this one, we have an Iceland and a wall token, Hero of the Next Worm, Soul Guide Latin, Alirios Inrupted, and a rare Underworld Bridge, two drops. Each non land card in your graveyard has escape. The escape cost is equal to this card, card minus cost, plus the exiles three other cards from your graveyard. You may cast cards from your graveyard for their escape cost, at the beginning of your end step sacrifice Underworld Breach. We have a forest. Devourer of Memory. Furious Rise, Mystic Repeal, and a rare Storm Wrath for drops. Storm Wrath deals 4 damage to each creature and each planeswalker. Very interesting card, this one. And we have a Swamp and a Publicity card. Heroes of the Reveal, Faithful End, Nessian on Beetle, and a rare, Tassa's Intervention, X and 2 drops. Choose one, look at the top X cards of your library, put up to two of them into your hand and the rest on the bottom of your library in a random order, or counter target spell unless his controller pays twice X. Nice card, this one. We have a plane, and we have a foiled thirst for meaning. Drag to the Wonderworld. Interesting Liar, Thundering Chariot, and a rare Enigmatic Incarnation. For drops, at the beginning of your end step, you may sacrifice another enchantment. If you do, search your library for a creature card with converted mana cost equal to 1 plus the sacrificed enchantment's converted mana cost. Put that card on the battlefield and shuffle your library. Interesting. And we have a forest. 
and a human token. Palax Statics, Impending Doom, Minions Return, and a rare Phoenix of Ash, 3 drops, he has Flying in Haste, Phoenix of Ash gets plus 2 plus 0 until the end of the turn, for 3, and has Escape for 4, Exile 3 other cards from your graveyard, you may cast this card from your graveyard for its escape cost. Phoenix of Ash escapes with a 1-1 one, one counter on it, and it is a 2-2. Two, two. Interesting. And we have an Iceland and a goat token. Agonizing Remorse, Farika's Spawn, Underworld Fires, and a rare Temple of Plenty. Enters in the battlefield, tap it. When enters the battlefield, scry one and tap it for a forest or a plain. And we have a swamp, and we have another foiled Nyxborn Marauder. Time Merit Chosen from Death Thrano the Singer One with the Stars and our Rare Again Dalakos Crafter of Wonders Now we have a Swamp and a Publicity Card Save use Chimera, Reverend Hoplite, Field of Ruin, and a rare Taranika Akroan Veteran, 3 drops, he has Vigilance. Whenever Taranika Akroan Veteran attacks, untap another target creature you control until the end of the turn. That creature has base power and techness for 4 and gains instability. And it is a 3-3. Interesting. And we have a mountain and a human token. Grey Merchant of Ashfodel, The Triumph of Anax, Rise to Glory, and a rare, Arashta of the Endless Web, for drops he has reach, whenever an opponent casts an instant or sorcery spell, create a 1-2 green spider creature token with reach, and it is a 3-5, uh, sorry. Have a plane and a wall token. The binding of the Titans, escape velocity. Sweet Oblivion and a rare is a mythic. Nice. Polo Kranos Unchained. Four drops. 
Paul Kronos enters the battlefield with 6 plus 1 plus 1 counters on it. It escapes with 12 plus 1 plus 1 counters on it in instead. If damage won't be dealt to Polukramos while it has a 1 1 counter on it, prevent all damage and remove that many plus 1 plus 1 counters from it. For 3, Polukramos fight another target creature and it has uh, escape for 6. Exile 6 other cards from your graveyard and it is a 0 0. Great card! And I have a swamp. And this will be token. Reverend Hoplite, Grey Merchant of Ashfodel. Siona, Captain of Pylos, and a rare Woe Strider, 3 drops. When Woe Strider enters the battlefield, create a 0 1 White Goat creature token. Sacrifice another creature, Scry 1. Escape for 5. Exile 4 other cards from your graveyard. You may cast this card from your, your graveyard for its escape cost. Woe Strider escapes with 2 plus 1 plus 1 counter on it, and it is a 3 2. Interesting. Have a swamp, a human token. Great art again. Kalef, beloved of the sea. Idris growth. Alirius Interrupted and a rare is another mythic Tassa Deep Dwelling for drops. A god he has indestructibility. As long as your devotion to blue is less than five Tassas isn't a creature. At the beginning of your end step exile up to one another target creature you control, then return that card to the battlefield under your control, and for four tap another target creature and it is a six five. Great pool. We have a plan and a human token. Destiny Spinner. Clotis Design. Mirror Shield and a rare Atris Oracle of Half Truth for drops. He has menace. When Atris Oracle of Half Truth enters into the battlefield, target opponent looks at the top three cards of your library and separates them into a face down pile and a face up pile. Put one pile into your hand and the other into your graveyard. And it is a 3 2. Crazy. And you have an Iceland and a Pegasus token. Only two boosters to finish this booster box. Blood Aspirant. The Birth of Malatis, Fateful End, and a rare Dryad of the Elysian Grove, Great Pool, 3 drops. You may play an additional land on each of your, your turns. Lands you control are every basic land type in addition to the other types, and it is a 2 4. Great Pool. We have a Mountain, and we have Incendiary Oracle, Foiled. And our last boost. A 
Earthfat Nightmare. Ooh, great image this one. Anax Hardenet of In the Forge. Warden of the Enchanted. And a rare Temple of, of Malice. Temple of Malice enters the battlefield, tap it. When it enters the battlefield, scry one, tap it for a swamp or a mountain. And we have a forest. Ooh. Great foil, this one. Timerit chosen from death. Nice effect in this one. And we have a human soldier token. So, in this booster box we get 12, 12 foiled, four, 5 mythics, great mythics, and some very, very interesting pulls in this one. So, this is what I have to share with you. I hope you like it, you enjoy it. Until the next time, see you.